Novak Djokovic coming into Wimbledon this year with a lot of questions, but after his first round performance, he's definitely silencing some of the critics. What's up, everybody? It's John Eric Pollock, continuing coverage here of the 2024 Wimbledon Championships. It's a fun tournament every single year, and of course, every year, Novak Djokovic, a big topic of discussion. Not only is he probably the greatest player to ever step foot on a tennis court, but one of the best players to ever step foot on the grass courts at Wimbledon as he's won this tournament seven times. Now, typically, right, for Novak, if he had a draw like this that he has this year, if this was Novak Djokovic, Djokovic of old, we'd be saying he's going to walk definitely right into the semifinals. He may even walk right into the finals, depending on how this bracket's going to play out. But this year, as you guys know, hasn't been pretty in 2024. All he really has to show is that Australian Open semifinal, the Monte Carlo semifinal. Then he did make the quarterfinals of the French Open before having to pull out with that knee injury. And even that road, though, in the French, even though he did get to the quarterfinals there, it was not a pretty road to that quarterfinal. So, here it is, all these questions. Is Novak even going to be able to play? Uh, you know, as father time caught up to him, things are going so bad. You know, kind of the, the, the world's kind of crashing down on Novak here from all the fans, from all the critics, from a lot of media members. And then here it is, round one, after all these you know, things he's facing, he looked freaking great today. I mean, I, obviously the only difference that we saw out of him was he had a sleeve over his knee. But outside of that, that looked like Novak Djokovic of old. He played so well today, winning in straight sets, winning those sets 6-1, 6-2, and 6-2. And I want to talk a little bit about something they mentioned in the broadcast. This is something that Nick Kyrgios and John McEnroe were getting into, and Kyrgios really did a great job touching on this too, being a big server, a guy that faced Novak in a Wimbledon final. And they were saying how servers typically will do well at Wimbledon with that big serve being on that quick surface, and Novak does not play back deep. He stays right on that baseline there, and he's willing to let an ace or two get by him, but when he does re return, and we know he's one of the best returners to ever do it, when he returns, it's the server that has the pressure on them because that serve is getting back so quickly there. And for Novak, he did a great job of doing that here today. Now, here's the big thing with all of this, right? It's a great topic, talking point. Yes, he looks great. He's, you know, playing that, that, defensive, that great defensively uh, way that he always plays there. But here's the big thing. It's only round one he was facing a wild card. Let's just see as this tournament goes along. Let's see how this knee holds up as the tournament goes along. There's still a lot of questions out there for Novak. But right now, looking at round one, you have to be really happy if you're Team Djokovic here. He looked really good here today. All those questions coming in about the knee or if he's washed up or if Father Time has caught up to him. Definitely this performance is going to halt that here a little bit. Again, still a long way to go, but Novak definitely has the formula. He knows what it takes to win this championship as he's won it seven times. And we'll see. Listen, he wants to silence the critics. We know that. Big opportunity here to do it, do so because this draw is definitely favorable for Novak. And if we're going to see this type of performance out of him, look out for Novak Djokovic here. But again, big thing. Long way to go here. We're just through round one, but the early returns on Novak Djokovic so far look pretty damn good.